morning. Today is August 14th and we're here at the Council on Aging having our monthly board meeting. We did not have a board meeting last month because many of our members could not attend and we would not have had a quorum. I didn't know how to spell quorum so I just wrote down. <laughs> no, I, I couldn't. My Alexa wasn't working and I was saying, Alexa, how do you spell quorum? <laughs> I can't help you with that. Well, anyways, so many of our members could not attend. It's going to be that Mercury thing. Right? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just a little bit after 10 o'clock. Uh, we do not have any mail, uh, but we do have the, member, uh, the minutes from June 12th. They were supposed to have been read uh, last month. Um, these are the minutes. Uh, they were submitted by Dan Smith. He's our secretary. And uh, in attendance, Lauren Golda, Linda Gilbo, Dan Smith, Deborah Posa, Pauline Texella, and Joan Howland. Pauline Hudson was excused. But now I have to tell you something exciting. We have a new member with us today. She was approved by the selectmen. And she's sitting right here. And what is your name? <laughs> I know it. <laughs> I know it's here. Um, <laughs> but I'm having a senior moment. <laughs> Pat Medusky, I know. <laughs> Pat and, and Pat was here for many years as our yeah, outreach worker and our shine counselor and our little bit of everything sunshine. You were sunshine to us. And we loved having you here and we're so happy to have you back. Thanks. So, so you're here now uh, for at least 10, 20 years. So that's I wonderful. Hope <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah that's, we never let anybody go over. Yeah, no, no. Once you're here, you're here. Yeah. <laughs> um, and we have fun and we laugh and we talk and we let the people out in a cushion it know what's going on. Uh, this program is um, being recorded and it's vid videoed, of course, and it will later be broadcasted on the local channel 18 and on the town's YouTube channel. Um, YouTube channel. And again, I don't know if that's how you spell YouTube, but I think that's how it is. Um, okay, so may I have... Um, Someone approve these minutes. Um, basically, okay. the best. Okay, both of you. The second. Who we'll said second? Joan. Okay. Joan is called Jerry, by the way. Okay. So Deb and Jerry. Okay. Well, According to this, your last name is spelled with an E. That's not correct. That's right? not correct. Okay. Where, where is this over here? In uh, New Business, where it says accept Pat Majors. Okay. I just noticed it because I'm, I'm trying to memorize something. Uh, M-I-D-U-R-S-K-I. Okay. I'll fix that. Before. It's pronounced the same. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I um, already sent it in to them, so that's okay. The town has you down with a U. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's see. Under old business, the newsletters were distributed throughout the town, except. I never did get to the um, the two rooms, um, the FW and the American Legion. But oh. I but I have some, so I'll get them there today, and they'll have them for the rest of the month. Yeah, but everybody else has them, so that's good. Yeah. My delivery person had COVID, so he. <laughs> we can drop them off on the way home today if you want. Them. Really? Yeah. No, right on our way. Yeah. All right. Sure. Thank you. Okay. I'll give you fifteen for each of them. Okay. Okay. Because they do like them and they do. Oh, use you don't. Them. You don't have to pay us. Oh, you like fifteen copies. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you want to be paid, do you have a petty cash fund? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> no. This is a little too petty for that. <laughs> okay. Um. And under old business, we have down that the Akushnet Board of Selectmen voted to accept Pat Majerski's appointment to the Board of Directors. And again, I see that um, Majerski is spelled incorrectly, but we'll get that fixed. Okay, now, this is the good part. We had a use of building policy and with prices and, oh, and like who could, you know, use the building and when and all kinds of details. And the Board of Selectmen accepted it. So now, um, Robin has something to go by if someone asks Excellent. if they can use the building. And it's in writing, and nobody can really argue with it because it's already been approved, and this is how it is. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, so I've already sat down with a few um, of the group leaders. Um, 
I've gotten a lot of positive feedback actually, which I was so, not surprised by, but I, it went a lot smoother than I had anticipated. Yeah, that's good. Um, so I'm excited that you know we all worked very well together and we got good. two thumbs up from the selectmen. Yeah, so good. They're very impressed with our new policies. Excellent. Thank you, everybody. Okay, and I guess we'll start working on another policy some other time, next month maybe, okay. Um, now, under new business, it's all kind of in these bulletins, and these are the ones that are all, all over town, and as of today, they will be at the VFW and the American Legion. Um, and on the back of these bulletins, very important, is a schedule, and it's there for everyone to see, and they can tell what's going on here. Um, I just want to highlight a couple of the things that are um, going on in here. Um, we have trips. Um, we have a young lady at the desk, um, Jan Barrett, and she was forever down in New Bedford running uh, trips. Um, you know, you pay, of course, and to different places, and now we have her here. And she's wonderful, yes. And on Thursday, October 17th, People will be going to Salem, Massachusetts, just in time for Halloween. And um, are you going to be styling there this year? No, not this, not, not this year. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> my, my friend the witch over here. Um, <laughs> um, on Thursday, November seventh, Foxwood Casino. And people really do like to go to Foxwood, but they don't want to drive there anymore because of, you know, the traffic situation, the bridge situation. Um, and on Sunday, December seventh. They're going to uh, the Newport Playhouse. It's a dinner theater, and the name of the show is Lend Me a Soprano. Um, they also have a cabaret afterwards, which is really fun. Yeah. Yeah. Are you a soprano? <laughs> no, I'm <laughs> afraid not. Okay. <clears throat> Maybe they would borrow you. Um, today, August 14th, um, there is an end of summer barbecue being put on by Coastline. So a lot of people signed up for this so they know about it. On Wednesday, August 28th, there's a dietitian, uh, Barbara Canuel, and she is from the community nurse uh, for a nutritional, well, she's going to be here doing a nutritional demonstration. A, lax, a light snack will be provided. Um, you do have to sign up, though. So anyone who wants to come to this is on Wednesday, August 28th, here at the council. It's at 1230. Just got Jan or uh, shall we know? Um, and it's a healthy thing. Um, inside of here, we, we ha also have information about uh, Paul Schmidt. He is a representative, and he's here um, on the first Monday of every month. If anybody ever has a question, he's here. You know, he comes in, sits down, relaxes, and then people come in and talk with us. Yeah. And we have Jennifer Lido. She is our outreach specialist. And uh, you can make an appointment by calling the front desk if you should need to talk with her. She helps out with things like the Boston Food Bank, Mass Health, fuel assistance, medical related concerns. She's um, very, she, she knows quite a bit. And Pat knows all about that too because that's what you did before. Right? Right. Um, let's see. Uh, we have a new veterans uh, officer. Uh, he started like maybe about a month, month and a half ago. His name is Bradford Fish, and he's located right at Town Hall, second floor. Fish, F-I-S-H? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, My friend Ron Pornia did a great job for oh, many years. Ron was wonderful. Yeah, Absolutely. kudos to him. I had his little boy who's now in his 30s in school, yeah. and I met Ron and his wife way back when, and they were very, very nice people. Yeah. Um, on page six of our newsletter, it really explains a lot of our exercise programs. So if someone isn't sure which program that they might be interested in, um, it's all right there. You know, and I can recommend just about every program that's there. I've seen, and I've seen these people over the years, and I have participated in some of the programs. Hey, Ice cream man. I'll have a Sunday. Yeah, we're ready. A little musical entertainment for you out there. So sorry. No, it's not a problem. 
Um, it's just the president. Don't worry about it. Well, well, let me, well, let me we, we like music. We like jokes. We like, we like one another. We like the people out there. So, so we're, we're good. Um, so that's what's in this month's newsletter. Um, they're usually available at the beginning of every month. Uh, at different businesses here in town. Um, and maybe next month I'll even name those businesses. You know, but if I do it now, I, I'm sure I will forget. Um, is there anything here? Does the board have anything that they would like to add, any information or questions? No. Okay. There's something I want you to think about, and Lauren and I need to discuss this afterwards, um, about the chairperson, because uh, Pauline was chair for many years, like about 10 years, and then I've been chair now for about 10 years. We always had a vice chair and a secretary. Um, some of us have held every single job on this committee, um, and it might be time for us to make a few changes, and um, what we'll need to talk to people about later is that it, if they would be willing to take on one of these positions, and Lauren has promised to keep them very, very simple. Yes. Yes. Okay, so our next meeting, no one has any questions? All right. Okay, our next meeting is on Wednesday, September 11th. It's going to be here at the Council on Aging, probably in this room, and with these lovely faces, so, um, and John behind the camera, and um, I guess we should say, oh, no, I need... Uh, someone to say that we're going to adjourn. Uh, the, the meeting is over. I need a motion. I will be adjourned. Okay, Jerry, and I need a second. Second. Okay, Jerry. And yeah. All right, and at this point, then I will say over and out. <laughs>